Melissa Clark is one of the food writers for the New York Times, and I absolutely detest her recipes. She has a knack for putting garlic in everything. That's why I was glad to see that we had her cookbook, Dinner in French, here at the Goffstown Public Library. We have many excellent cookbooks, and I was delighted to see that we had Melissa's because I didn't have to pay for it. I got to see it and check it out and see what she put garlic in that I wouldn't have. Cookbooks at the Goffstown Public Library. Come check out our collection. Hi, I'm Michelle, an adult services librarian, and my pick of the week is The Moment of Tenderness by Madeline Lengel, the author of beloved children's book, A Wrinkle in Time. This book collects 18 short stories uh, that she wrote between the 1940s and 1950s before the publication of A Wrinkle in Time. It deals with the highs and lows of life and asks us to find the beauty in the everyday. This collection was brought together by her granddaughter and is really lovingly rendered. So if you enjoy her writing, you'll definitely want to check this one out. The best part is we're talking about the moment of tenderness in our evening book discussion at the Goffstown Public Library in October. On the first Tuesday of the month, meet here at the Goffstown Library at 6.30 to meet with other readers who enjoyed the book and want to discuss it. Hope you can pick it up soon. Hi, I'm Stacy, the Teen Services Library Assistant. And it's 1967, and Kitty Granger uh, has stumbled upon a world of spies and conspiracies. See, she sees this strange man um, on the London bus that she's on one day, and her hyper-focused mind causes her to follow this mysterious man. And bam, it leads her right into a meeting with a Russian spy ring. Now, Kitty has some, what some people call peculiar tendencies, right? She's acutely aware of her um, surroundings. She fixates on certain patterns. She um, has a, an amazing uh, observation and awareness. And she also easily disguises who she really is. See, she's autistic and those talents are actually what, and traits are what get her out of her encounter with the Russian spy ring. And the British uh, special agents working for the Majesty's government take notice and they ask Kitty to come into their espionage operation. So if you like historical fiction, especially set in a Cold War setting, um, then I suggest you read The Secret Life of Kitty Granger by G.D. Falkson. Uh, and come on and spur Kitty on as she trades in her shopkeeper smock for gadgets and gizmos and James Bond action.